their Jack's Creek sirloin with burnt butter. Oh my god, what the hell's happening? Is there an accident or something? Okay, so 20 minutes later, we're still here. Okay, legit, like, I'm kind of worried what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> what is up guys welcome back to another video with mina all right so just really quick we're having breakfast we're about to head out to matt wilson to do some autumn foliage Woo! not do some like uh, <laughs> <I> mean, <laughs> photos of photos I'm of with, with we haven't autumn. had coffee yet so we haven't had coffee yet so we are going to do some autumn Autumn foliage viewing. And then we're heading out. I'm also picking up Rochelle. So, see you guys in a bit. Bye. Oh my god, what the hell's happening? Is there an accident or something? What the going on, me? <laughs> it's 10.40 now. We're trying to get to Mount Wilson by 11 o'clock because we have this 12.45 lunch at I think it's called Eights or Ates at Blackheap. I don't know. Comment down below. I don't know what's going on here. Are we gonna make it, Mina? <laughs> Drum is good for the vlog. Okay, so 20 minutes later, we're still here. Just kidding. It's only been like five minutes. Lies, lies. <laughs> okay, legit. Like, I'm kind of worried. What's going on? <laughs> Today, sorry. <laughs> what is up? So we are now here in Blackheath. So change of plans. The original plan was to go to the Breenhold Gardens in Mount Wilson, but we there was a bit of drama earlier, as you saw, where there's a bit of traffic on the way to Mount Wilson. So that would have messed up with our plans. So we decided to come to Blackheath for a Scottish restaurant that we want to check out called Eights. I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Eights. It's pronounced Ates. Apparently, it's a Turkish word for fire. Is that right, Mina? According to Google. Fire in Turkish. But in the Philippines, <laughs> that's pronounced as Ate, which is like older sister. Ooh, look at all these leaves. Yes. Our booking's at 12.45, but we're hoping we can get in by 12 o'clock. So while we wait, let's do some B-rolls. Local rosé that's really nice. That's actually nice. And it's like, like legit, that's really good. Having this focaccia with budarga dip, budarga, with budarga dip with caviar. It's... Oh my god, so much umami, the acidity, and it can taste like the olive oil in that too, like high quality olive oil. That's freaking amazing. Oh my god, I love like the herby flavor. You can taste the thyme in the focaccia. It's like super fluffy in the inside. It's freaking amazing. So next is this yellow fin tuna that comes with caper, sour cream, and lemon. It looks like it's got a bit of olive oil in there too. Oh my god. It tastes like the tuna is like cured. I don't know how, but it's silky. It looks like light umami. It goes so well with the capers. A bit of acidity in there. And it's creamy at the same time. It's so good. Such a good tuna dish. Okay, so next up is their Jack's Creek sirloin with burnt butter. I love burnt butter. They also ordered like sides of fries with nori and also some salad because your boy doesn't eat enough vegetables, so I'm glad we got some salad. The fries is okay. It could be more crispier. And it's so smoky and buttery. Love the burnt butter. Got so much flavor. Love the texture. 
trying some of that kingfish now with a bit of that cabbage. Mm, the cabbage is so good. The fish, I feel like it's a little bit overcooked to my liking anyway, but it's still good fish. But the cabbage is so good and buttery too. So that was amazing. Let me just close the door. So that was amazing. If you are in Blackheath, check out Eight or Ate or Eight. It's pronounced Ate's. We're gonna get coffee and then yeah. we're heading out to Breenhold Gardens and do some autumn foliage viewing. Right. A few moments later. So we got our coffee. Thanks, Mina. So we're now going to the <laughs> we're going to the gardens now. Let's go. So we are now here at Breenhold Gardens. We are doing our autumn foliage viewing. And as you can see, we've got like trees are going red and orange. We've got trees are going yellow. I'm still here with Mina and Rochelle. They're doing their photos somewhere out there and you can see there's a lot of families so with Breenhold Gardens there is an entrance fee by the way of $15 per person for adults I can't remember for kids probably a bit cheaper but like for adults it's $15 and there's two areas it's like a foresty area where we are at right now and then there's a more garden looking area although the whole thing is called Breenhold Garden there's a more garden looking area not far from here Russia and Mina is like right there Did you guys get your shot yeah yeah, yeah. take a look Oh wow, look at that. Model. <laughs> this place is absolutely beautiful. Love the smell of the air here. It's fresh, smells so crisp. The air is very crisp around here. And there's just a lot of photo ops, as you can see. Look at this, a lot of photo ops. There's so many photo ops. All right, so we're just gonna keep going around, do more photos, do more footage maybe, but we're gonna go and explore the place a bit more. And that's it for our short trip here to Mount Wilson. Highly recommend Ate in Blackheath. And this is what Mount Wilson looks like during autumn. <laughs> See you next time. See you next time. Did you enjoy this trip? Mm-hmm. Thank did. you very much. You're welcome. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button. Smash it if you wanted. Do not forget to subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit that notification bell so that you're up to date with all my videos. I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then. Much oh <laughs> <Peace>. <laughs> See you later. Bye. <laughs>